What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Conception Plus Made of the Twelve Stars. In the last episode, we met up with some of the Star Maidens, we got to know them a little bit more. Ruka we didn't do too too well with, she, we made her mad by accident. <laughs> um, but in this episode we're actually going to go ahead and start with the Labyrinth. Um, we don't have any items that we purchased yet because we only have 2600 gold and you can't really buy much with 2600 so we're just gonna go ahead and head into the start of the labyrinth and see what happens we haven't done anything yet wait actually let's go to the tavern real quick um i want to see if i can accept these quests now i don't know i think this is just it's just like if you get it you get it if you don't then i don't know Ooh, we need we, we would we really need that though. 10,000 gold? But I don't know how to accept quests. <laughs> exactly. Um. We don't have any quests to submit. Um. But yeah, I don't know how to accept quests. I thought it was just, uh. Automatic? Actually, let's actually check the tutorials real quick. Um. It should be on there. Um. Uh, Combat 3, battle start, blah, 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 attack is out of play. Tavern, here we go. Um, okay. Oh, okay. Our receipts, our receipts automatically, so be sure to check the details and the check request. Okay. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Alright, so. We just have to try to remember what we need. <laughs> In that case. No, never mind. I, what I was gonna say, I was gonna take a picture of what. What did I do? <laughs> If it isn't Sky, how unexpected are you shopping? Right. Yeah. Are you Colette? Yes. I'm, del I'm delivering bread to some restaurants. I have several substantial customers. Whoa. Oh, I must hurry back to the bakery. I need to go now. Please come and buy some bread. Well, See you later. All right. <laughs> how you doing? So I don't know. We can't remember this. <laughs> um, I think it just. I think it actually just tells you. Like under quest or whatever when you go on a menu so i'm not too too worried so we're not gonna worry too too much about it we do need to do this these two for sure though just so we can get that money because we need it anyways let's just go ahead into the stardust labyrinth and see what happens let's do it all right spring clouds labyrinth first floor start from here yes all right it's the first time we're going to a labyrinth let's see what happens So this entire episode might just be Labyrinth. Maybe. Uh, gold portal. Are located somewhere on each floor, and you are able to proceed to the next floor by reaching it. You must search for the gold portals to reach the deepest parts of the Labyrinth. There are a variety of different contraptions aside from gold por uh, por portals and Labyrinths. Oh my gosh. Uh, you can check the layout of the dungeon with the radar map, and you can switch how it's displayed. Okay, that's I remember that. Uh, you'll enter a battle with impurities by coming into contact with them, whether you have the advantage or not, or in, or in battle. Okay. Okay, cool, cool. Seal doors. Star children. Seal master star children. Okay. Okay. Before anything. Here we go. Quest. There we go. This is where we check it. Okay. So we gotta be sure to find one of these. Equal Equalios? Um, and, uh, Pseudosay. 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 Uh, yeah. I guess we'll see what happens. This is so cool. <laughs> Alright, let's see what happens. We're just, we're just gonna the map in that corner right there. Um, let's the other lady in the corner. Child's Clothes Plus. A child's outfit made of cloth. Uh, tech resist 50%. Okay. Alright, cool. <laughs> we got it. Alright, so, like, do you have to. Are battles just, like, random? Or. Do you have. Can, can you attack? Um, ah, okay. There we go. So you, you can move faster by holding. Okay. I guess you can't attack. Let's go. All right, battle screen. Uh, chain drive the items down. That one. So. Here it goes. 
Sparkle of Shine. Ha ha! Another call? Uh, we don't want to enter that right now. Let's finish this guy off. Heck yeah. So. Alright, cool. So yeah, I don't think you can't. I don't think you can attack. Don't let your guard down. Oh, okay. So you just have to bump into them. They can't bump into you. Okay, cool. Watch your surroundings. Okay, this is new. Uh, press L1 while selecting your action to switch between three camera distance settings. So you can confirm the purity sign with your current screen this way. Here goes. Oh, almost like that. Play or? Damn. Okay. Let's attack regularly. My turn. Good night. Oh yeah, and if y'all don't know, I always fight all the battles, so like there might be a ton of like fast forwarding through some battles throughout the throughout the playthrough or cutting out the battle completely. I haven't really decided what I want to do yet. Um, but I guess we'll see. See what happens, you know. Uh let's go and you shine. Is that guy off? But I think I can fast forward it. Yes, I can. Okay, cool. No attacks. Oh, I attacked from the front. I didn't even do that. <laughs> We're out of. Okay, that's fine. Or. What? Okay, whatever. That's very Next up. Um. Jeez. Next up. You can only attack one. Alright, there we go. So. Got two potions. But yeah, I'll probably be doing a lot of like cutting out or fast forwarding through battles, something like that. More than likely. It's probably gonna happen. You're just guarding the. Thing right there. Let's go. Okay. Wind, wind, wind ups and strong attack. The furious attack can be divided between weak attack and strong attack. So when is our the monsters prepare for an attack? In a way, you can tell one is coming. Remember to watch for these wind up, wind ups or wind ups, so you can prepare for these types of attacks during battle by taking actions like moving out the out of the way. Okay. Uh, status ailments. Okay. Way too easy. We don't have enough to do anything. <laughs> I love that. Alright. In that case, I'll just have you on guard. My turn. Uh, have to attack. Take time. Go. Oof. Next up. Try to get the speed drive going. Ooh. Done yet. <laughs> 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 um, we still need to do items and mana stone. Uh, down them because they ran out. I'm not done yet. I don't want to waste too, too much items. Just gonna go heal myself. Let's use this. <laughs> Next up. This game is not easy. <laughs> Obviously. We're gonna go ahead and you know, use potion here also. I think nobody dies. Having our kids die would just Way too easy. not be good. <laughs> Next up. Do. Next up. These guys are kind of beefy, honestly. Uh -huh. Ooh, ah, no! <laughs> Atrocious at all. Alright, let's just finish this guy off. We're done. But yeah, we're gonna be doing this. Look how strong I am! Look how strong I am! Stronger now! Thank you. Alright. Okay. Um, equip team best. Okay. 
all healed? Yeah, they're, they're healed, but I'm not. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and heal myself real quick. These two. Alright. But yeah, we're gonna probably be fast forwarding through these battles because I don't want y'all to have to deal with every single battle we, we go through. Meaning, I'll have to be making tons of notes on my phone to find out what parts I need to fast forward, you know? Okay, well, anyways. Uh, this is the last room, so. Should I get some more? Don't let your guard down. Alright, auto. Uh, we're not going to worry about that. Here goes. Um. Back in time. Next up. Eat. Right, there we go. Some of battles like to be really quick. Alright, you next. Attack you from behind, so we have shit. Don't let your guard down. There we go. Think about my strategy. Just shine and attack. Shine, attack, shine, attack. So. Alright. Oh, there's one more. Come at me, bro. Let's go. Come at me. Oh, we can't shine anymore. Attack really. My turn. Here goes. Yeah, we're not gonna worry about trying to chain right now. We're not gonna worry about that until we can actually have more Next up. Uh, defense. Because our armor is not the best right now. Because one, we didn't have enough money. So enough gold to actually get some good equipment. So that's one of the reasons. Okay, let's see. That should do it for that. Let's continue on to next floor. Seem are we running faster? Oh, okay. So you press circle to like either go fast or go. Okay. okay. I don't want you. Monostone on y'all. That lets you communicate over long distances. Like, oh. yeah, that's pretty cool. Haha! Right. <laughs> right behind you, Let's bro. Go. Um, I don't want to lose that. Like, so we're just gonna attack Next normally. Up. I mean, yeah, we'll be taking damage, but like, I mean, what can you do? <laughs> My turn. No. We're done. All right, and we got to level up. Cool. Got another boost. Yeah, I think leveling up recovers us complete uh, fully. Learn flick. Heck yeah. All right. Yeah, I believe that's a healing spot. But yeah, I'm so far, I mean, this is like Conception 2. Um, so I'm kinda of, so kind of used to the way everything works. Um, this is obviously it's just this is on a PS4 rather than on the Vita. Like I played uh, Conception 2 on. But I mean like I can get used to it. It's, it's the same thing. You're just literally playing it on the same screen. Oh, on a bigger screen, I mean. Petroshka. Stone. We got all these items too. Oof. That dude just came right after came right after us. Oh, okay, I don't know what happened, but as long as they don't have the advantage, we're chilling. Okay, for this, I'll go ahead and shine. Just so we can have to worry about one of these guys. My turn. Go. 
Next All right. up, let's do a flick. How much flick does? There. All right. Here it goes. Decent damage. Oh, and paralyzed him too. Here it goes. Yeah, that's fine. All right, cool. So it'll definitely be worth flick a lot. We got two more. that just fought every single thing in this in that little room right there we're still we're, uh we're not doing too too great on mp but i mean we got mana stones um but yeah so we should have we should have uh completed that quest then let's see yeah complete and we haven't done any of these other ones yet so not worry too much Go ahead and avoid you. And we're gonna go ahead and head up here. We're gonna head, up to, we're gonna head down to the next floor. But we have to fight these guys because they're blocking the thing. Oh, no, we don't. <laughs> Let's continue to the next floor. Avoid battle with them right quick. Um, Let's keep on going a little bit. Oh, man. This, like, this brings me back to uh, uh, Conception 2. Like, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, Conception 2 is just something Don't else. It was a lot harder than you would think. Like, I was going, I was going crazy, yo. <laughs> um, literally, oh damn, 4,319? 4, God dang. All right. <laughs> but yeah, Conception 2, like, it was really easy in the beginning. But like, I feel like the further you, you just like got into it, it just got harder and harder. Like, well, that's... Don't that's let your that's normal Way for RPGs like this. But it's just like, it's a matter of how it's difficult it got. Like, I didn't expect it to get, to get as difficult as it was. Um, but it did. Like, especially in Chapter 7, I, I'm pretty sure it was Chapter 7. Chapter 7 when, had to, when you had to fight Alex, I, I was struggling so, so hard. Um, and in chapter 7 or chapter 6 or whatever chapter it was where you had to fight Alec. Um, because, like, I'm telling you, it was not easy, y'all. Like, it was so hard. <laughs> like, oh my gosh. Like, I don't know. <laughs> it's just like, you, like, imagine, uh, let's say, let's say you're playing Pokemon. Let's go. Right? Um, imagine this. So you're playing some Pokemon. With, uh, let's say you're level 52, um, uh, Raticate. I don't know. And then you have to face a freaking level 99 Entei for whatever reason. As y'all can obviously tell, that's my turn. That's not easy. It ain't easy whatsoever. And that's pretty much what it was. And like, like to the point where you have to like keep fighting that one which one because you have to get, you have, you have to fight it and beat it to actually up. continue the story. Like that's how I felt about freaking facing against Alec, because like we're done. Alec was he was hell beat y'all. Like he was not easy. Like he really was not easy at all. But like I mean maybe I'm just terrible at strategizing. I mean I, I wouldn't be surprised. Oh yes. Okay these things these things these. Balloon type stuff. We need to beat them as quickly as possible because they have tons of experience that they want that they give you. So you gotta make sure that they don't run away. 
because if they run away, see, this is what they're trying to do. Look at that. They, so, see, now the only thing we can do is try to we can use Flick and beat him. Probably won't. Oh, it did, it did. Yes, it did. All right, so and we get all that experience. 45 experience, like, that's good. That's really good. May not seem like a lot, but it is actually a lot. <laughs> and you look like awesome. And you also look cool. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Divine Aegis. But yeah, every single time you have one of those, y'all, you, you you better fight them because like they are hell to beat. But but I but I think in Conception Two. I had a specific strategy to fighting those. Like, I used this one move that was super strong against them. Um, um, I believe that's what I did. I used a strong move, and then I used another move that wasn't as strong to beat them. And it, it worked so well. I mean, you can't do that yet, because we haven't gotten any super strong moves yet. But yeah, whenever you see one of those, like, be sure to fight them, because if you don't, you're missing out on a whole bunch of experience Don't that you let your possibly get. Here goes. Um, Divine Aegis. Divine Protection that boosts your mental fortitude. Alright, cool. Let's just use Flick. Try to get this guy. My turn. Alright, cool. I'm stuck on Alright. Next up. But like, I mean, like, they're strong. Like, they, they really are strong. Like, those balloons or whatever. I don't know. I don't actually remember what their actual my enemy name was. I just call them the balloon. <laughs> the balloon enemy. My turn. I think they're called balloons. But like they they give you tons of experience. You're done, so whenever you get a chance to fight one of those, do it. You will not regret it. Unless you end up losing. If you end up losing, then you probably might regret it. But if you don't lose, then you're you're, you're, pretty, you're pretty much good. I don't see anything special in here. So let's not worry about that. Let's just go ahead. Like, I think I want to try to get to at least level 5. I think level 5 would be good. But I don't want to fight every single enemy just because fighting so many enemies can be annoying. <laughs> then having to, like, fast forward that or cut it out or whatever, whatever I end up doing with it, it's just difficult. Well, not difficult, it's just annoying. And sometimes frustrating. Anyways. Ooh, we got some MP, we got an MP healing thing right there. Okay. The more, the more we keep getting items, the more I'm gonna keep using uh, Team Best. Um, because the better equipment they got, the better chance they have of doing well. That, ma that makes no sense whatsoever. But, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, actually, uh, real quick, I want to check, how do you use the chain, the chain, uh, the chain, real quick. Um, ooh, the chain drive, that's not what I want. I'm back to, uh, bond gauge. Oh, I forgot, I forgot there's like an actual way to like, use it. Whatever, we'll figure it out as we go. Um... Anyways, let's keep going. She came, he went running for that thing right there. Like, I try to take advantage of getting all the chests that we possibly can, because you never know if they'll end up being really good. I don't know. I mean, my turn. well, they probably won't be really, really good items, but they won't be good items that will help you out in the long run. Um, let's go. So that's why I try to get, to get them. There we go. Next up. Um... God's gift. Hit point good. Uh, status. Okay, so just kind of like Pokemon. Fire beats grass, obviously. Uh, grass beats earth. Earth beats water. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Uh, when light beats dark. Dark beats everything. I don't know. Um, oh, we're good. Your light element. Points left and back. Okay, we should probably actually use that one. Um, I don't want to waste MP2 too, too much. My turn. It's kind of honestly, it's kind of sad how you can't have heroines with you as well. 
Because I know in Conception 2, Got another boost. Uh, you could have the heroines along with you, and, th and that would really help. Maybe you can later on in the game. We have to want know it until we get to that point. If there ever is that point. I guess if, there, if that doesn't ever, if that never happens, not that big a deal. But what I like to happen, yeah, it'd be it'd be nice, you know. Okay, I'm not going not going to worry about getting that MP because we don't need it just yet. That would just be a waste. Like I said, like, when it comes to battling, I'm not gonna worry too, too much. Cause, like, honestly, I think it would end up being fine in the end. Right, you. I do want to get all the chests, though, so that's why we're, like, Let's go. kinda taking our time with, uh, everything. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that did nothing. Let's just use Shine. There we go. Next up. Flip. There. Off. So, so we're getting all level ups. Do they have a do the star children have a max level? I would assume they do. Um, how do I check? I just want to check. How do I check if they have a max level or not? Oh, here we go. Okay. So, all of them are going to be 10, it seems like. Okay, cool. Um... those two enemies right there just to get those chests or we go ahead to the next floor um but yeah we'll probably get pretty decently far i think i mean i think we can we're not worried about getting that because we don't need it for the field right now um let's definitely get these chests right here athletic shoes a pair of light shoes made to accommodate runner speed okay that might that's gonna be a gift for a heroine at some point Now, because we don't know who likes shoes and who doesn't like shoes or whatever, so it's gonna keep it going. Um, okay, this just leads to the next floor. Okay, I'm not more about going there. Yeah, I just want to explore because, like, before you go, before you like decide to just advance. Oh, jeez. <laughs> before you decide to just advance through the, the dungeon, I'd say always explore because you never know what, what you can find. Like, there are so many items that we've picked up that will be nice to have for like a later date. For a later time or whatever. Um, how are we doing quests? We just we just completed this one. We haven't done okay, we completed that one. Okay. We haven't done anything else though. I do want to fight try finding these guys though, because I do want to fight them so I can complete these quests so we can get that money. Um but but yeah, take advantage of like exploring dungeons. I don't just rush through it. Like that's how I like the thing about it. I don't like to just rush through it because you might you might miss something you might miss something huge. So that's yeah, something to think about when you're exploring dungeons. It doesn't really matter. Uh, we're going to heal. Um, that's pretty much for any RPG, any JRPG, like uh, Pokemon. Every town to explore, you never know what you'll find. Um, whoa, what's this? Equipment or items offered at the, at the altar will change into items of similar value that you don't do not own. Offered items sometimes won't change. Sure. Made in slap. Sound brings back people back to to themselves. Here. Okay. Oh, you can only do it once. Okay. All right, that's cool. Oh, yes. 
Oh yeah. These guys just pop up out of nowhere. Don't let your guard down. So, like they do, they do tons of damage. Um. Yeah, I'll try to paralyze you. My turn. Okay. Now. There. Oh. Ah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here goes. Go finish you off. There we go. We're done. But like, seriously, look at that. So much experience. Just from one little balloon. Um, we're almost at level five. Oh shoot! Oh man, I didn't know where I, I didn't know where I don't was going. I won't lose. <laughs> All right. Um, I don't want to risk fighting this guy. So can we just run? I'm not done yet. Okay. okay in that case, let's just go ahead and just heal real quick. Let's use so this. So I don't die. Okay. My turn. There. I won't lose. Wait. There we go. Oh. I mean, we hit level five, so that's cool. Got another boost. Learn Blitz Blow. All right, nice. All right, cool. Now let's go ahead and, and just leave. <laughs> Not worry about about fighting anybody else. I think we can go ahead and head up to the next floor now. Because we got everything we can get for now. There's nearly nothing nowhere else I want to go right now. Um, sometimes, if you like, just walk around for a bit longer, they do reappear. Those that gold enemy, but it's very rare for that to happen. So that's why I'm not relying on it too too much. Okay. Forbidding to feel something. Okay, we're all heal. We're all healed completely except for you. There we go. Let's heal with Mana Stone. And let's face our first boss, I guess. Let's see what happens. Before anything, we're gonna save because you never know. What happens? Whew, all right, let's go. What? What is this thing? It's completely different from all the fodder we've beaten or fodder we've beaten. Damn. Ugh, it won't let us pass unless we defeat it. Sky, go and put down that wild horse. I'll try my best. Listen, Sky, use Mechanite on stronger opponents. What's Mechanite? Well, about that. The star children on your teams. Can borrow your strength to unite and become star angels. <laughs> star angels are in the vault form of a star child. Star child. Okay. Mechanite is when four star children unite their powers to transform into a powerful form. Okay. We'll definitely right. use that. Let's All go. right. All right. Cool. I think this is the thing we had to beat to complete that one quest. Let's go. Okay. Oof. My turn. Okay. Um, a slashing attack that greatly increases the chain drive. Right. Um, go. Ow, ow, ow. Let's go ahead, Mecha Knight. Yeah, let's do it. Alright. What does this do? Magical attack that is charged to the max. Target all void. Okay, I guess we'll do it. Oh, it does attack. Okay. Ooh. I'm not done yet. Let's go ahead and use po a potion. Let's use this. Thing. My turn. And we got the chain attack. Cool. Change drive, gut gaze. When you attack an impurity, your chain drive will uh, gain will increase. Once you have gained a certain amount of of the speed of the chain effect will activate. When chain activates, the effect the impurity turn speed will go down. That's good. During chain drive, all impurities turn speeds will be slower. Okay. I meant to read the rest of that. Um, before we do anything, let's go ahead and just uh, get the info on this guy. So he's he's weak from from the left and right. Okay. In that case, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and use this again. Weak point there. We go. Let's blow. Go. Side. Two. 
Did that kill me? Oh. I'm sorry, everyone. Bro. You've got to be kidding me. Wow. That seriously just happened. Wow. <laughs> that seriously just happened. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> My turn. Wait, what just happened? Okay, that was... Alright, that wasn't as good as what... Okay. Let's not worry too much. Um... Uh, which is the right place? Oh, we don't have anything. Okay. Let's use this. Wait, wait, wait. Way too easy. Just so they can make a knight. Yeah, I know that works. Yes. Okay, we're right, we're right, we're right. Because I don't want to lose this. Okay, come on, we can do it. Um, so let's go ahead and use Mac code. Slide right here. Because he's, he's he is doing tons of damage to us. Um, we have four. Let's use this. Use it. My turn. So we can survive two hits from this guy, but we can't survive. Three. That's something to think about. Okay. Could use this extra heal. Um. I don't think we need right now. Um. Yeah. We don't need to do. Well, we can't. We can't take another hit though. Um. Yeah. I can't use an item. So like, I'll just use an extra heal. It's kind of a waste, honestly. But we need an extra heal just so we just so we die. <laughs> Next up. Okay. Let's go. We're gonna try this again. No. Chain. Okay, we're good. We're good. Mac code. All right, come on, we got. We got. We got. We can do it. All right, see what we can do. We can do it. Um, so we can we can take one more hit, and so can the Mechanite. So let's go ahead and use the flip. We can we can take one more hit. Yeah, okay, we're good. We're done good. yet. Okay. Can you take this out in this next hit? <sighs> okay. oh, I don't want to risk it, so I'm just going to go ahead and just heal up. Heal up. Uh, just potion plus. I don't want to risk this. Dying? Again? <laughs> so, there we go. We're good. We're good. Not done yet. And, uh... Okay, we should be fine now. No. Come on. And then Mecha Knight, you can finish it off. There we go. That should be it. Yes. All right. <laughs> is it over? I can't believe we actually lost. <laughs> but it's okay. It's all good. We beat it this time. And we got a few level ups, which is pretty great. All right. And we completed the quest. I think of. I've gone pretty far down now. The lower floors harbor even stronger impurities. You shouldn't overdo things at the start. You better off, you're better off returning to the surface. Yes. Your star children are tired. I'm sure you can. You are tired. Yeah, you are too. Now that you mentioned it, we have to go back the way we came, huh? It's fine. That's not true. Take a look, Sky. Yeah. You see that dimensional rift right, huh? right there? Dimensional rift? The dimensional rift were placed in the labyrinth during their creation. Anyone besides the impurities can use these to return to the surface. <laughs> Come on, Sky, let's use the dimensional rift to get out of here. Oh my goodness. That was... <laughs> that was something else. <laughs> now then. How do you feel after going inside the Stardust Lab? Right. I think I can do this. I mean, we didn't die. We didn't die once. <sighs> so we can do it. <laughs> well, you, you, you do have the best guy possible. Oh. Welcome back. So wait. Mahiru, were you waiting for me? <laughs> Of course not, I just happened to be here. But I'm glad you came back in one piece. Well, well bye, I'm going back on my walk. Was it really just a coincidence? Nah, she was worried. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm impressed. I see, so you can go quite far down now. <laughs> At this rate, you'll be very you'll be able to defeat the first impurity guy very soon. Allow me to explain. I think now is a good time to explain how to try mate. Try mating is a class mini ritual, but with two partic participating star beings. By doing the ritual with two star maidens, well, you can produce superior star children. 
However, the Star Maidens must be sufficiently pow powerful to do so. A Star Maiden's power will increase as their bond with you becomes more profound. Well, about that. Therefore, you can only conduct tri mating with the Star Maidens you are closest to. Now you can take on two Star Maidens at the same time. <laughs> Good job, you perv. Since you'll be dealing with two, two at the same time, you'll need tons of energy. You have to, do, you have, to have a high level otherwise, there's no point <laughs> to it. And there's still Star Maidens. Not all of them would enjoy tri mating with each other. I'm sure many would feel embarrassed to be exposed in front of each in front of others. <laughs> then again, it never hurts to do some interesting moves with them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, one more thing. Tri mating won't deepen your bond with the star mating. If you want to deepen your bond, you should stick to, with class mating. <laughs> you better keep that in mind. Fine. All right. But also remember that you will need stronger star children to defeat stronger enemies. It's best to use everything you have at your disposal. Come on now. No, nah, your smug face is really deceiving when you say such harsh things. That's simply not true. Oh, the Star Maidens understand what they're getting into. That, that is what I believe. I, I never thought the day would come to utilize tri -mating. What? What do you mean? Yes. At least for the last few centuries. There hasn't been a god's gift who plasmated with multiple Star Maidens. That's why tri -mating is only known among the scholars of history. It's been passed around merely as legend. Do you understand? To us, tri -mating is a new concept. That's right. You better be prepared, Sky. You'll be the one experimenting with all the ladies. Right. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. I will now introduce you to the other students of the Academy. Come with me. All right. God's gift, you're not a student here, but you should get to know each other. Like with the 12 Star Maidens, I hope you will all get along. Thanks. Nice to meet you all. This is a special class for the Star Maidens. Outside of being the Dean of the Academy, I teach this class. Oh? This class is comprised strictly of the 12 Star Maidens. It was hastily put into the curriculum a month ago, after the Star Chaos. The Star Maidens attend this class every few days each week. So my hero also have to join To them. build profound bonds with the Star Maidens, you must visit the Academy often. God's gift, be sure not to hit on the other female students. What the? I know that already. You don't need to tell me. I am sure you are tired from everything. Please head to your lodging to rest. All right. Yeah, I think I will. All right, guys. That is actually going to end off this episode of Conception Plus, made up to 12 stars. We started the first labyrinth. We died once. <laughs> Hopefully we won't die anymore after realizing how much damage we went through. Um, in the next episode, we'll go ahead and submit the quest that we've completed, get that money, um, and then we'll probably purchase some new, uh, some new uh, items, new weapons and such, new armor. Uh, probably hang out with a few star maidens, uh, classmate, get some stronger star children, and yeah, and we'll probably head back into the labyrinth in the next episode as well. I don't know yet, but I guess we'll find out. Anyways, thank y'all so very much for watching uh, this episode of Conception Plus, made of 12 stars. And if you have any tips or tricks that you'd like to give me, or that you have in mind, please let me know in the comments down below. I'll truly appreciate it. And I'll see y'all next time.